Welcome to John's Metal Detecting Adventures. Here we are, digging up history, bringing it all back to life. Let's see what we're going to find today. Seventy-one. Copper. Oh yeah, look at that, another silver. And it's Victoria's sixpence. Four minutes into the dig, straightway silver, Victoria, 1890, uh, 1896. <laughs> Can't beat that. Four minutes, silver, straight away. Down here, 55. Oh, piece of lead. <laughs> lead. Book it. Sixty nine. <laughs> oh dear. <clears throat> Good number. Got a ring. Fifty one. Good number, we think. Hmm. It's down there anyway, we think. Yeah, somewhere. <laughs> Shit. Oh, come on, where is it? Oh, oh it's lead. Oh, lead. Lead. Lead bucket. A bit of pottery there, probably about uh, 17, 17 to 18th century. Mm, it's a bit deep pot there. Hmm, glazed on one side and put on the other. So it's some, probably a planting pot, I should imagine. And we've got a signal in here. See what that is.
Gone to 69 now. Look at that. Oh, look at that then. A bit of uh, clay pipe pottery, the stem. The bowl should be there somewhere. Oh dear, bit of rubbish actually, after all that. <laughs> 57! I think I got it out. Oh yes, we have a coin. Here you go. Well, I reckon you know, I'd be Victoria personally. We've got it out, 66. It's a coin. It's in here, 66. What's that then? It's in there, 66. In there then. 66. And it's a piece of trash. And that was a good number, 66. 87. I come to this. What's that? 87. 89. Uh-oh. Oh, 89. Oh, it's a big one. That's what it is. It's a big carter. Size of that. Big. George III. Penny. 1806, I think. That's what that is. Seventy-four. Seventy-four down here. Oh dear. Bigger then. That's a buckle. <laughs> Unusual buckle. 19th century maybe. Buckle. A bug and a coin. Bug and a coin. <laughs> well, let Mr. Bug there uh, go down and we've got a coin. But who is it? Still the fifth half penny. 62.
Toothpaste tube, 1950s. Oh, wow. <laughs> Look at that. An old tractor. I have to give it to my mate. I bet he's been playing with. I bet he's been playing with this <laughs> old tractor there. <laughs> Bottle top. There's a bit something different there out of this hole. <laughs> American, one cent. Do you believe that? One cent. <laughs> Unusual. <laughs> Had to come on really because uh, I found an American coin. Can you believe that? All the way here in the UK across the pond. <laughs> Can you believe that, eh? Hey, look at that. 83. Yes, sir. Uh -oh. Some sort of... Uh, Antibiotic tube. Fifty nine. Down there then. Shoe buckle, 17, 18th century. I've done it completely, but I thought now instead of going across the field, I've gone up and down. This is the field we're on, look. Here. See? Right here. With Pendle Hill in the background. <laughs> and then, of course, I've come in the middle of a load of cow poo and a uh, hole. One hole. And then, boom! Look at that. 
da, 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 da. straight out of there, sitting on there, is a 1944, if I could see that, sixpence of George the Sixth. I don't know how I missed it, so we'll pick that up. Uh, it's definitely George the, uh, yeah, George, George the Sixth, sixpence, no doubt about it. Uh, 1940, 44, just at the end, oh, not, yeah, in the Second World War, isn't it, isn't it, period. It's in cracking condition as well. So it just shows that you still can miss things. So I'm going to go back up again now, in the same spot I've been doing for three days, and see if we can, like, just like knots and crosses, crossways, and see if we can get any more silver. That'd be nice. I'd, I'd like to find something a bit older, but still, silver, silver, it'll just have to do for now. Da, 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 1944. George VI. Yeah, I like seeing, I like finding my silver. Yeah, it's, it gives you, gives you a buzz, gives you a belt. I found a giant hammer my, 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 my mate, Stuart, from Spinner Desk. And that's the only hammer that's come off, but it was a big one. I think it was a crown of big. That was big, but no other hammer's come off. Let's see if we can find some Ahmed! Call it all Ahmed! Call it all Ahmed! I'm here! Come on! Please, we need you! <laughs> well, we'll just have to see, guys. Well, we've got 63 in there. What is that then? 63... And it's something... I think... What is it? What's in there? Oh, there it is. Oh. Well, it's a kind, but don't know where it is. Well, this is 83, wherever that is. Mm, it. That's a buckle. <laughs> a buckle. Well, that is. It's a broken buckle, actually. 65 <laughs> oh, There you go Hey Victorian Half minute 1868 74 <sighs> Get it with a pinpointer first. Before we dig any more. <laughs> Big piece of dross. Not even lead. 69. Oh, there it is. You can see it from here. <laughs> there it is. Look. There she blows. Georgian. 86. 88. Down there. Big piece of, uh, oh, it's a mold, mold, part of a mold trap. <laughs> well, that's quite deep. 
Oh, there it is. <laughs> it was a kite after all. Can I leave it? Sixty six. It's a spindle wheel, oh that's interesting. <laughs> I don't think it's old, but it's a spindle wheel. <laughs> ah, 18th, 19th century I should imagine. Spindle wheel, oh, what do you know about that? Yeah, it's a cat right? Piece of tin. There's one big nut of some kind. <laughs> Sounds like that. Oh, brass bucket. Oh, we've got it in there. Oh no. A big plate of some kind. Now look. Copper bin then, is it? Or brass bin. He's a kite. Ah, there you go. That was a bit iffy, but 36, 38, 38, something like that. But it's half a penny of Edward. Edward the Seventh. So we found today. So we've got some sort of, I don't know, some sort of uh, uh, farm mechanism fitting. Buckle 18th century. 18th century shoe or hat buckle, D buckle probably uh, early 20th century, some sort of lead thing, I'm not really sure what that what that's for there, could be a weight that actually, could be a medieval weight, could be a small medieval weight, plum weight, uh, some sort of uh, brass cap, bit of pottery, uh, spindle whirl, 18, 19th century. 
18th century George III. Another George III. And so Victoria, George V, all variations of King George V, VI, uh, and Victoria half pennies. And then we have uh, one coin that's uh, one cent, uh, American. Just the highlight, somewhere, up there. And then we get to the silver. So we've got a uh, silver sixpence. 1896 with the uh, Queen Victoria with the old veil and we've got a George the sixth and that's 1944 Second World War so that's what we've got <laughs>